as I work through my triangulation view, I may discover some tight-knit groups from intermarriage, perhaps from within a certain faith or geography. This is called endogamy, and it can make genetic inheritance difficult to trace because the same ancestral DNA can be contributed from different branches of the family tree. This is where the circle view might come in handy. Again, it's best to have segment data to work with so you can identify people who share genetic data at the same position on the chromosome rather than just in general, but in common with groups will also work. Here in the circle view, I see that the filters I had applied in the triangulation view carry over, but now I see my matches displayed around the edge of a circle with the total number of centimorgans we share next to their name. If I click on Kate here, I see her yellow lines connecting through the circle and the connections are shown in bold. This is an example where the view can handle more data, because if I widen the centimorgan threshold to 100, for example, Kate still comes through loud and clear with those yellow lines across the circle and I see where she's connected to other individuals and groups around the perimeter. I can use the filters in the circle view to start analyzing the connections between groups of people based on degrees of separation. So, for example, if I'm ready to start working out on the limb from Kate, I can filter to her kit and then increase the degrees of separation to see other people from my list of matches who also share DNA with her matches. The lines across the circle show how these clusters of people are related. So now I can do the same thing I did in the other views and start working my way backwards through our connections to identify our shared ancestry. I can click to see if they have a tree, see if they have documentation, maybe contact them, look for hints, etc. Each of the Roots Finder tools helps me see the data in a different way, but leads me back to the same basic principles. Start with what you know, identify what you want to know, analyze the evidence, document your work. It's all in one place with Roots Finder. Nice!